Hey guys, what's up? This is Al from DroidShark.com with another Android game review for you guys. And in this video, I'm going to be covering Frozen Bubble by Powell Alexander Federinsky. Now, this game is pretty much just like Bus Move, just with way less colorful graphics and a lot less features and different things like that. But you get the gist of the game. Um, the actual objective of the game itself is to shoot a bubble and match the correct color to the correct bubble above and actually break the blocks. So let's go ahead and get started and take a look at the game itself. Alright guys, so let's go ahead and take a look at the game. You'll see the icon just says Frozen Bubble with one of the actual bubbles. So we'll go ahead and launch open the game. As you can see, here we are. There's really no menus, no anything. It's just a very simplistic game. So as you can see, there's a little arrow there that we can scroll with our optical joystick or trackball if we have one. Uh, you can see touching the screen actually shoots them. So you do need to have the optical joystick or the trackball. Um, so I'm just going to use the optical joystick. And you see when you scroll to the right, the arrow moves to the right. Do it to the left. It moves to the left. You can click the optical joystick to actually do so as well. And all you have to do is just shoot the correct color bubble to the um, that is down here to the corresponding bubble up on top and get them to match perfectly. And when you do that, the actual bubbles will explode, as you can see. You'll see there's levers that um, start to come down, so you want to make sure that the bubbles that you're placing up there do not cross that blue line down here, or else you do lose the game. So we're just going to go ahead and shoot a little bit of bubbles here and show you some gameplay. You can see you can indeed bank off these snowy walls. And uh, the more bubbles you break, the more points you get, As you, um, but the point is to just clear out everything. So let's go ahead and try to do so. There are a few sound effects, but they are pretty annoying. Um, I do not like them. We'll turn the media volume up. And you see the sound effects aren't even very loud, so you don't really get a, a good sound experience with the game. You'll see sometimes when you have a little extra uh, bubble hanging off the cliff and you attack a corresponding bubble, it will fall off sometimes, so it's good to try to get those extra bubbles out of the way, like so. And just showing you guys a little bit more gameplay. You see the bubbles actually stick to the top, unlike Bust Move, when those actually just ricochet off, which is something I like a lot better from Bust Move. And there we go. So we cleared it out. You see it lets us know it's a winner. And that's really it. You can tap menu. You can colorblind mode on. So when I tap on that, as you can see, it actually has little actual indentations on the bubbles themselves, which is great. Uh, full screen on and off. So you see I have my notification bar and I can interact with it, which I'm like keen on. I can have the sound off or on. So now I just turn it off. I'll turn it back on. Don't rush me. I can turn that on or off, which has no time limit. I can go it about and I can hit more and I can new game and put level editor. As you can see, it takes me into the market and lets me download an application called Frozen Bubble Level Editor, which is absolutely free. So I just go ahead and download it. You see it's downloading up in the top there. And it's successfully installed so I can launch open the Frozen Bubble Editor. Here I am, I can run the tutorial, I'll just cancel it. I can pick a bubble place it wherever I want. Really, really cool features. And that's Frozen Bubble. Alright guys, so all in all, it's pretty much just a free watered down version of the game that I reviewed before, uh, Bust a Move. It's absolutely, uh, this game is actually absolutely free in the market, so you might as well just download it. It's a lot easier to play with a trackball, so if you guys have a trackball, I recommend getting this before you buy Bust a Move, just to kind of help you to see if you like this type of game. I personally do, I have Bust a Move, so I much rather prefer that. Uh, so much more fun in my opinion, but that's pretty much it for this Android game review Make sure you guys check out my YouTube channel. It's Android's world, and I'll see you guys in my upcoming videos